Parker and son accused of hunting the man down and shooting him. The son still on the run tonight. 7 Action News reporter Amory Laflame shows us why he is one of Detroit's most wanted. When you see the video, it's hard to believe this was all over a paper delivery, coupons. But Carlton Perry almost died, and he lives in fear every day that Jafar Taufik will come and finish the job. I threw the newspaper on the porch. It's all documented in this surveillance video from November 27th here on Montrose on Detroit's west side. Carlton Perry delivering coupon flyers, something police say Mushtaq Abdul Kareem clearly wasn't happy about. He came out and started yelling at me, so he picked up the paper and threw it at me. Carlton called his boss, who told him to take a picture of the house to ensure they wouldn't deliver there again. That outraged Abdul Kareem and brought another man outside. Police identify him as 21-year-old Jafar Taufik, Abdul Kareem's son. And that's when police say father and son went on the hunt. The son drove up and pointed a gun at me and shot like three shots, but they missed. He says the father also tried to stab him before the men returned home. And you see him clear as day, him and the father or the mother arguing by the side of the house. Uh, Taufik grabs his gun, which is in plain view, starts shooting in the air again. But Carlton's nightmare was far from over as Taufik and his father went after him again. I just felt the bullet hit my back and I just fell to the ground. And they felt like I couldn't move or nothing. All I could do was just pray and hope that the police come like they say they would. He says the father and son then tried to get him into the van. And I think I would have never been, I think I would have never heard from again. I think I would have just disappeared. I think they would have just basically killed me and just threw me somewhere. Mushtaq Abdul Kareem was charged with attempted murder. He's now out on bond, but his son Jafar Taufik has been on the run since the shooting, while Carlton lives with the emotional and physical scars of what happened that day. Sometimes I just want to cry because I'm basically like wounded and I'm looking like I got scars. Even if I did like get over it, I got scars on my body from that situation. Jafar Taufik is 5'10", 150 pounds. We think this guy is still in the area. We think he's either on the west side of Detroit or he has huge ties to Dearborn. Unpredictable? See, my problem here is we got honest citizens, Detroiters, making an honest living out here doing a job. And you got this guy reckless, no regard for anything. And armed. If you would shoot a, a, a newspaper boy or a delivery guy, or somebody trying to give you coupons? Who else would you shoot? Now, as always, there's a cash reward for the arrest of Jafar Taufik. You can call the U.S. Marshals anytime at 313-234-5656. And remember, you can always remain anonymous. I'm Anne-Marie Laflame, 7 Action News. Thank you, Anne.